Good morning guys. Today I'm visiting a client uh, that I visited a year and a half ago at, after 11 o'clock and um, I was shot at this guest house. A year and a half ago. So this is the guest house. Well, two gates right here, the double story place. This is the guest house I was shot at. I was shot at last year. I'm not nervous at all. Yo, my heart is racing. Um, it is so, so, so weird. This is the exact same gate I was shot at a year and a half ago. Hey. I wish those guys uh, came inside. Then we have closed the gate and then we shoot from upstairs. <laughs> yeah. Guys, so I was, we were standing here yeah, and I saw Baron and them come through on the road there and parked, parked right behind that tree right there at the back. So as they arrived, I ran then down the stairs. As I ran down the stairs, um, I came through onto the grass, ran across there and found Baron in there. I wanted to go through that gate there, but that gate was then open. So as I went through, Baron and them came through the actual gate we met here. They asked me, what else do I need? So I said, nothing, let's just get ourselves and go. So as we then went through the gate, that gate opened and as we went through the gate, he literally came from that pillar around the gate and as you go around around the gate we walked through and then shot us through there so Barry ended up there and I ended up in this little corner right there I'll go there I'll go outside right now but I was laying there waiting for him waiting for him to come around into the into that yard and yeah have at us but yeah we we saw them from this side and the bathroom side yeah because I was standing yeah I was standing here and I could see see the two trees there I could see the car's boot open in beyond those two trees there. So that's how I knew that um, they were standing, standing around. They were walking around in the yard with, um, with, with automatic weapons. Cool. So as I said, I was walking actually that way. And then that gate opened and I had around the most of the So going, going through this way, I'll show you how close this actually really is. So. We walking, we were walking this way. Barry was literally, Barry was literally on my right hand side, like right, right where we are right now. Okay. So as we then walk through the gate, so then we got shot like right here. As we got shot right here, I fell more or less where I'm standing right now. Barry fell over there. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, Barry fell over there. And I think there was a little bushy thing right here. I then crawled over this bush. And I actually laid here, right here where I'm right now. This is where I lay. Now I was laying down here, what was thinking about getting as close as, as possible to the physical gate right here. This it wasn't paving yet, it was grass here. Anyway, so I was laying here and literally watching the gap, waiting for him to come through the actual gap to come finish us. Yeah, it sounds stupid to say that, but to come finish us off. And I mean, it never happened. I actually wanted to crawl around the tree but now in my mind thinking if I go wider as you can quickly see if I go wider it opens up the, the gap more for him to see me to able to be able to shoot me so I stayed as close as possible to this wall so that he couldn't see me it couldn't shoot me when he came through or I wasn't I don't know what I was thinking so my whole thing was close a gap between where he can see me as possible close that gap so he couldn't see me so I thought in my head if I go around this big moose tree he would be able to so if I'm here check it just opens up a bigger gap for him to shoot through to be able to hit me so I wanted to actually crawl around oh, sorry actually crawl around and lay behind there because I was the only one without a gun but anyway so yeah the company this is a year and a half ago feels like it was yesterday I'm still getting heartbeats and my heart's pounding and stuff like that now the gate's opening, your my heart is pounding like it's going ape so let me just is everything okay that side? Oh, there's CMS there. <sighs> anyway, so last time I walked through this gap, we, I was literally yeah in this gap right there. And as I walked past, something caught something caught my eye right there. So as it caught my eye, I looked across and he was standing there with the R5. Now that is probably just all. Let me quickly just do the paces. One, two, five. It's six paces. He was standing six paces. He was standing here. We came through that gap right there. 
so like I said, as I was standing, let me just get back to my spot. So as I was standing right here, something caught my eye right there. As it caught my eye, I it was this arm. With my left arm, oh no, it was my right arm. With my right arm, I said, Barry, watch out. And as I said, watch out, I wanted to pull him back. And as we were, it's more or less, yeah, as we turned around and we started running in, the shot was fired. And as the shot fired, went through his leg and into my leg. Yeah, and I'll show you pictures of the leg. Anyway, but yeah, I shut it off completely. But I know that the car was behind that tree right there. Eugene was hiding behind that tree. Uh, Robbie was inside there. And yeah, they, the firing and the shooting even started. Yeah, there used to be a year, it's still here. Yeah. Just open this up. Anyway, I don't know if I'm getting into shit, but anyway, let me just open this up. Let me show you. They fixed it. Okay, they more or less fixed it now. But it used to be a huge dent into the actual... Can you guys see that? Yeah. It used to be a huge dent where the bullet actually ricocheted and it was it came out this way. So where the bullet hit the... So because Robbie was shooting from behind that bush right there. So, and the guy was more or less... the guy was more or less standing right here. So he hit this right and made a little like a dent outwards this way. So yeah, very, very scary. Can't believe it was... And these guys saved my life actually. These guys with Robbie and them were on the scene first. CMS, Uncle, uh, Uncle Manny and them. These guys were on the scene um, that day. So yeah, very, 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 very strange. Let me just stop one. Cheers. He just drove away. He didn't, he didn't want to be on camera. It wasn't him that was there, but he's patrolling this area generally. But yeah, that's my story guys. It is, it's very scary to think that it was literally a year and a half ago. Bye. So yeah, I just asked her to please close that gate. And she said, no, 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 the other gate's closed. You must use this gate, please. Very, I asked her to please close the gate because I'm actually very nervous. And she said, no, no, you're going to use the same gate. <sighs> as nervous as hell. I don't know if that's normal, but anyway, yeah. And now 